guys, welcome back to Threshold Gaming. Uh, today we are going to be playing the NASCAR Heat 5 uh, career mode. I know I'm in my, as this says, my fourth season of Week 13 here in the Truck Series. Um, but better late than never, I guess. But anyways, we are going to be running at Dover in 50 laps. Uh, let's get our work assigned. Okay, so I've got all that done. Go ahead and assign everything. Okay, we got all metal. That'll work okay, because that's all I can do right now. Let's go ahead and get this started. Next set. Then go ahead and select your car. And then go to event. I want to try to do some more Ryan Asker Heat 5 videos just until, well, I still want to probably play it while not, I'm playing 21 Ignition, but um, it's probably going to be a little bit before I get back on 21 Ignition again because there's so many problems with that. And I want to be coming out with a review uh, with it here very, very shortly. Um, so if you guys are enjoying the content on my channel, please let me know. Um, leave a uh, like don't forget to hit the subscribe button for more content um, if you're liking it uh, let me know um, if any content creators are watching this or if uh, anybody has a channel is watching this uh, please let me know on if there's anything I can approve on how to improve my channel and uh, yeah uh, a few practice laps here and then see what we get And make sure I had the right setup selected. Okay, yeah, custom. All right, now take, take, take. Get up on the bank in here. Well, and miss the ship. <laughs> At least this game is able to is a lot more playable than uh, 21 ignition is right now. At least I'm able to... Well, and what comes up on you pretty quick? At least I'm able to use my shifter for this. 21 ignition, you can't. I'm playing on my uh, Thrustmaster T-150, and the one thing I can use is powder shifters, and I'm not a big fan of them. I mean, I'll use them at a road course, but for as actually like on this, I just... I, I prefer a range pattern shifter. And I know a lot of... A lot of uh, Old school guys out there that, um, like using these pattern shaper too, so okay, run one more here. Now obviously when it goes to sequential that'll be a different story with the next gen car, but uh, we'll get there when we get there. Let's see if I can get this that quicker. Okay, that was quicker. Alright. Go qualify. All right. Let's see where we qualify it. Hammer down. All right now, dig, dig, dig. Yeah, didn't miss it that time. Anyways, let's see where. Oh, as I smacked the wall coming out of two, because I wasn't paying attention. Let's go, yes, just a tick, not much. Let's see what we can get out of these laps. spreading in the 18 there but which is a good thing and guys uh, all assists are off on this AI is at the highest difficulty okay well, that's about what I got last time was a 20 uh, yeah 20 okay so fit that's pretty good usually I'm not really good at uh, Dover so Time to go now. 
Damn it. This ship again. I'm still trying to get used back. I'm trying to get used back to my uh my thrustmaster shifter. So I didn't spend a lot of time with uh, spending some time with uh, my uh, G27 shifter because I've been doing some uh, computer races or races on PC. I'm still new to that a little bit, so I've been trying to do some NR2003 and getting used to it a little bit. So I'm gonna use a break a little bit just to try to get the truck ready to do this one. Okay, well, that seems like that's well, it was probably about our uh, best qualifying time, so let's see where that uh, puts us at. Oops, damn. Okay. A lot better than I expected, so I wish I could carry that all, all the way through, but obviously I go to the third round. Oops, so. Let's go. Okay, get back in there. Let's go. Let's see, that's the one thing I wish 21 ignition that will let you do is come from this stop off the pit road or even drive out of the garage. It, that part didn't really really matter to me. But at least let you come out on your own on the uh, warm up lap instead of dropping part out 100 feet from the surf finish line to start your time lap. I need 
better than that. As long as I don't smack the walking around too. That's a lot better. Let's see if I can get that hand drive off. I'll be able to get you know, what I got in the second round, but I'm not sure I'm try it. Mm -hmm. Okay, well, that's probably about the best I want to get, so. Third. I was really hoping to get that one time, but oh well. Hey, at least I'm stopping, starting in the top five, so now I just got to stay in 10th and I'll stay inside the top 10 and uh, see how this goes. Start on the other side. Get up to the gears. There's a lot of improvements uh, 21 needs to make. For one thing, the spotter, from what I've experienced, is not that accurate. I could have somebody either side of me and rut, like one second before they uh, take spin me out, they say that they're there and you have pretty much no time to react whatsoever. Plus you, have, you ain't got no rear view mirror. Which I don't know why they don't have that in there. Um, there's there's still a lot of things that needs to be fixed in 21 ignition. I haven't played it since the newest patch, but it's hard to do, especially when you have all have all these issues and everything, and having the game crash and, and having things unplayable. That's one reason why I haven't really started career mode. I've only done one career mode race, and I haven't done anything else other than that. I'm actually surprised I'm running as well as I am here because I'm not usually that good at Dover. It doesn't matter if I'm in trucks, it's in the Ore Cup, I'm not really that good, not usually that good here. Maybe it's just one of my lucky races, which I'll take it. I don't even know how big the lead I have. Oh, two and a half seconds. It's not huge, but... It's still a good size gap and it's still growing, so. Doesn't mean it's still sticking, it's running through the center good. And that's the important thing. Fall a pit in the first stage or not? That I don't know. Some way, if I'm leading or something, I always end up finding a way to screw myself on, out of the win by pitting. The entire temps are good; they haven't really fell off much. The right front still one has fell off the most, so I'm not loose or anything. So that's a good thing. The truck's handling really good. And plus, the uh, setup I'm using is a custom setup. I can't remember where I got it at. I got it on YouTube. I just cannot remember where. Like I said, at least this game is still a lot playable and enjoyable compared to 21 Ignition. thing is, when you're playing on a wheel, you do not get no vibration feedback. While I have not had no vibration feedback through the wheel, I've only gotten it with the controller. And you really can't drive unless you have that uh, vibration. Yeah, 
him almost a four and a half second lead. That's big. I didn't realize I'd get this big of a lead. Damn. Okay. If nobody else is pit night more pit, but we'll see here. everybody want to do oh nope ain't nobody pit nine pitting so okay now like I said talking about 21 ignition I will be having a review video come out um, here very soon go to the gears And I know that I just started this channel about a month and a half, two months ago. And I know that I'm not credible compared to uh, some of the creators out there. And I understand that. But I want to try to make it to where I can be. Uh, sorry, I had to pause it a second. To where I can be. Um, uh, uh, have useful information for you guys. Oh, okay, sorry, I had to pause it. I just wanted to talk about uh, 21 Ignition, and uh, I just didn't want to mess up my uh, uh, race on this. So, let's continue on with it. I'm really lucky to be in the 
super, I'm very shocked when I'm running this good, usually I'm not. Flag, yeah, definitely will be putting the distance. Second stage one. Good job. Going to pit at this stage. I'll keep the tape where I'll keep everything where it's at. It's been good, so let's keep it where it's at. Not 
treasure here, maybe. There's a deceit here. If you guys have any questions or comments on 9.1 ignition, um, feel free to ask. Um, I will. But uh, well, if you uh, if you want, you can subscribe to my channel and uh, ask me those. Um, you can ask me on my uh, Facebook and stuff. Um, but yeah, if you guys have any questions about 9.1 ignition, whether to buy it or not, or anything, or anything you want to know about it, just uh, feel free to ask, and I will do my best to uh, give you what information that I can. Okay. Uh, I'm only going to take right six. It just uh, right, took all four of So 
for this video um i hope you enjoyed it um that last runner was a little intense <laughs> but um don't forget to hit the like and subscribe button um if you enjoyed it please let me know in the comments below um if there's anything you would like to see or if there's anything you'd like to know about that sort of information um please let me know and i will do my best to give you what information i can and uh, if you have any questions about things I experienced from it, just ask me and I'll do my best to uh, uh, let you know on that or um, uh, send you guys to some videos of uh, stuff that I've experienced. So, um, like I said, that'll be it for this video. So if you liked it, um, please let me know. Give me a like and subscribe. And have a nice day your race. So, um, we'll come back to that and uh hope you guys enjoyed it and i will see you guys here to turn race for over so thank you for watching i appreciate it and i'll see you guys race thank you